Hey Collective, we're gonna do a quick energy check. We're gonna see what's going on behind the scenes. I've already pulled some cards. So I've already picked up some energy. Some of you guys, um, this could be you or somebody external from you. Take what resonates, leave the rest for the next person. Somebody is worried. Somebody is, you know, possibly feeling grief, trapped in fear, feeling isolated. Um, whoever this person is, I said, Spirit, who's this worried, paranoid, isolated person? Queen of Swords, Gemini, Aquarius, um, Libra, okay? I feel like this person had what they thought would, would be a good idea to disrespect your name, okay? I feel like um, whoever this person is to you, they try to walk away from this without people noticing that they were the, the person who did this. I don't know what this person did, but the moon seen it. This person tried to walk away as if nobody seen them do this to you. Three of swords, ten of wands. This is heavy betrayal right here. Okay. They thought that they were going to get away with this, but see this little bird right here? Those are your ancestors. They seen what this person was doing. They could have been telling people, do this, do that. Um, leading is what I'm getting. They were the leader. This reminds me of another reading I did. I said, somebody's going to find out who the real ringleader is. Now, what they did to disrespect your name, I don't know. Witchcraft, love spell, binding. Let's see. Oh, this is like heartache. Okay, this is the, the, the Ten of, I always tell you guys this, this, the Ten of Swords, the ultimate betrayal, an ultimate betrayal cannot come from somebody outside from you. This is somebody with that's in your circle. Okay, this has to be somebody that you trusted, you felt loyal enough to tell secrets, you, you looked at this person as somebody that was... This was she this was a queen of swords in the reverse. Manipulative. This is the type of person that um, um manipulates. They get information from you and they they're like, okay, I could use this information at a later date if this person ever does something to me to make me mad. Yeah, there was a lot of dishonesty here. Um, I don't know who, you know, guys, you're going to have to take what resonates. This person is in their emotions now. This person is feeling paranoid. Okay? They're feeling isolated. I feel like because this person is under karma. Um... Yeah. They're feeling the pain. The pain that they cause you. You could have gotten tattoos with this person. They could have, what I say, like leading people. Like you do this, you did this. You, you posted this day. You, I don't know. This person disrespected your name somehow. Could have been on the World Wide Web. This is somebody that you work with. Yeah. <laughs> They're watching you. They were watching. They were hoping to see this three of swords, ten, see you in this energy. This is what they wanted. I don't feel like you fed into this. Let's see. This is somebody who likes to... You, you tell them secrets... And they hold on to that for a later date in case, like, arsenal. Arsenal. Like, 
oh look at that she just look like this is the, this is what i'm you're telling them something and they're holding on to it like oh i'll hold that for a later date yeah because this is who they are karmic show me this energy spirit yeah i feel like i feel like you move forward i feel like you moved forward without trying to seek venge vengeance or because the chariot is victory it's balance it's taking action okay i feel like you were guided to walk away from this situation and let your ancestors and the archangels handle this because i feel like this is the ring leader this person was always always um waiting for you to reveal certain things it it you may have took you a long time to trust this person and tell them stuff see how this person's armored up Five, five, five. This person is going through changes. Like, I feel like this person. Why did this person flip on them like this um, spirit? Why did this Queen of Swords flip on the collective like this? What happened? What I'm hearing jealousy, envy. Jealousy, envy. Um... Could it make this person act out like this? Yeah, maybe it was a lover. Maybe you got with somebody that they wanted. Maybe this is what caused it. Could be a sibling, because the lover's card represents sibling. Could be a Gemini you guys are dealing with. But they always had it out for you without even realizing that their spirit had it out for you. And the moment you revealed like you could, it could have taken you a long time to reveal whatever this was to them, and they were like, "Got it." Yeah, some of you guys, this could be a lover, okay? Some of you guys, this could be a sibling. Some of you guys, this could be just a Gemini, okay? They were just waiting for you to, to give them that one information that they could use to disrespect your name. Yeah, they took a leap of faith. Whoever that lover was could be dealing with an Aries, an emperor. They were waiting to feed that. They were slowly giving that information, risking it all. Risking a, a friendship, a relationship for dick. You gotta be kidding me. You betrayed somebody <laughs> for me? Can't be kidding me. They were always waiting for you to slip up and get that one good detail. <laughs> Show me what this Queen of Swords is going through. This was a manipulative person the queen of swords in the reverse is somebody who's very vindictive manipulative um also could represent an ex-wife ex-spouse um king of wands some of you guys could definitely be dealing with a fire sign you could have had a fire sign that you were dealing with this person wanted this person that person yeah they were waiting they were like oh shit you heard what she said you heard what he said you took note you took a picture she was dancing in the club you recorded what she said what he said okay got it 
Then they go and bring this information to this emperor, this king of wands, about who? This empress. Who's the empress? You collective. You know who you are here. If you were the one doing this sneaky bad behavior, disrespecting people's names, being dishonest, trying to get somebody else's man, then this is you. If you wasn't the one that was going through the, doing this, then you're the opposite one, or you could be this emperor, okay? Cause conflict, confusion. That's what this person's main goal was to do, was create conflict and confusion towards this emperor. And now, because of her dishonesty, you know, This person wasn't honest with you about their intentions in this friendship, this connection, this relationship. This person is feeling isolated, trapped, paranoid. Yeah, paranoid. Mm-hmm. Spirit said, this is the truth. Could have had a gang of people coming, coming at you. She could have been lying to this gang, making it seem like you were this, you were that. Not giving the full story. How she was manipulating shit. How she was being dishonest. How she was being the queen of swords in the fucking reverse. Because she was in her emotions over this emperor, king of wands. She wanted this Emperor King of Wands to walk away from you. Eight of Cups, the situation. For some of you guys, it worked. Yeah. Hoodoo, voodoo, dark magic, moon phases. They leaked some kind of photo, some kind of video. These were haters. I don't want friends like this. I don't give a fuck if me and you are not talking anymore. I will never. I, I have people that I don't even talk to anymore. I will never. What their secrets will go to the grave with me. I would never. Put somebody on blast. I would never. Because I know that I have daughters. I know how karma works. They could skip me and hit my kids. I would never do that to somebody. Never. This person could have first, middle, last name. Could begin with a T. I would never do that. You're going to have kids one day, baby girl. Would you like somebody fucking doing that to your kids? How dare you? This is, this is a form of magic. Manipulation. All because she was in her emotions about this fucking masculine. She wanted this masculine for herself, possibly. Wanted this masculine to walk away from you. So she sits there, pre pretends to be your friend. Until you give her that one information, that one thing. That's going to make sure that this masculine walks away from you. Fuck that shit, yo. The fuck? Mm. Somebody's first, last, and middle um, initial could begin with an M. Yeah, magic, evil eye, projections. What did I just say? What did I just say? This is what they wanted. This was the ultimate portrayal. This is somebody close to you. You can't get the Ten of Swords from somebody you just met a week ago. Sorry, that's not how this works. This is somebody close to you. Somebody that... This Ten of Swords hurts so bad, it pierced the Three of Swords in your heart. You could have grew up with this person. They burnt the bridge, Spirit said. They burnt the bridge. The bridge is over. The bridge is over. Bye -bye -bye -bye. <laughs> Come on. This is why I hate when people sit here and be like, yo, ah, ah, ah. Mm-mm. Nope. I don't need that. I don't need friends like that. I'm very selective with who I have around me.
It's hard for me to trust. Before my path, I was a, I used to trust openly until somebody gave me a reason not to trust them. Fuck that. I don't do that shit no more. Uh-uh. You're going to earn my fucking trust. What's this? Yeah, the mask, the veil, lift. I'm not waiting to that veil and that mask lift. I don't got time for that. I don't got time to be figuring out whether you in my circle or not. You're going to you're gonna show me. <laughs> I'm not openly trusting people. My discernment is too strong right now. And it's not saying that I'm running around here acting all paranoid like everybody's going to hurt me. No, I just learned through many trials and tribulations from people who I thought were my friends and clearly were not. Okay? Yeah. This person took a long time. This is somebody you've known for a long time. Old relationship. This is not a new relationship. This is somebody you've known for a long time that broke your trust. This is fucked up. Whatever you were telling this, this person, they were telling this emperor. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. This is a shady-ass fucking friend. And a shady-ass motherfucking masculine. Fuck that. Keep that shit over there. They're in isolation. Self-sabotage your relationship with them. I don't, I don't need that. They blindly self-sabotage their own connection with you. Okay? This person blindly self-sabotaged it. Meanwhile, you're sitting over here like this, Empress. These, you could have been somebody that got a lot of attention. This bitch was always watching. Whoever this person is. They couldn't stand that this is who you were. Yep, this was a fucking hidden enemy. Spivet seen it all. Even Spivet looks disappointed. This person's ancestors are pissed and disappointed in this person. This Queen of Swords in the reverse. She don't have to be a Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius. This could be the energy she was embodying at that time. Venge vengeance. Manipulation. Sabotage. Why are they paranoid, Spivet? Why are they worried? Show me why they paranoid and worthy. 606 could be significant. 39 years old could be significant. You could have went on your spiritual journey, your awakening at the age of 39. Why are they worried? Why are they paranoid? Because Spivet is giving them an ass whipping. Spivet called these people into court. Look at them. These are these people. They have to answer to the divine. Ooh, Spivet. This is why they're worried. They're going to have, they have to answer to the divine. This is why they're fucking worried. I said, why are they worried? Why are they paranoid? Because Spivet... The divine interceded. <laughs> the divine called also, I'm hearing, this person's ancestors into court. I'm hearing you don't have control over your, your child. So you're just allowing your child to run out here and be reckless towards this empress. Karmic, what, karmic retribution? I don't know what that means. Somebody help me here with that. This is somebody you celebrated with. Somebody you allowed in your house. Somebody from your past. Karmic retribution. Maybe maybe this person followed you from a past life. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. Could be a friend. I'm telling you, somebody you celebrated with. The video's about to shut off because I only have a certain amount of space in. So we're going to just keep rocking it out. King of Pentacles. This person wanted the status, the clout. They wanted to look like this. Mm -hmm. Three of Wands. I feel like whoever this emperor is, they're, they could be seeing who this queen of swords is for who she is. And they could be turning their back. They're, they could be paranoid that this emperor is going to come and tell you, empress. This is what I got for you guys. Mm-hmm. That they're coming with this Ace of Pentacles. This is what I got. Love and light.